Hello everyone, so today we are going to talk about our science project that is the development of filter code from Tocopatetelophilus lipids components to increase the efficiency of microplastic captures. The first section is in our introductions. Microplastics are in the tools nowadays, and they have a variety of detrimental consequences on ecosystems, especially in terms of water pollution. Currently, there are techniques to resolving the issues, but that is followed by the limitations as well. As a result of the above, we have created the way to for developing a microplastic trapping agents of non materials with lipids components from Jefferson seeds. As a result, the lipids components that might be used as a filter code to improve the efficiency of capturing microplastics. Next, let me give you some information. First, additions is the tendency of different particles or surfaces to attire together to attract between atoms. As a result, we developed a further lipid code based on this hypothesis. And the plant that we are interested in is jackfruits, because jackfruits is a plant that is easy to find in the local area of Thailand. And as seen in a table, the seeds have the highest lipid contents. Microplastic, a tiny plastic particle that result from both commercial product development and the breakdown of larger plastic. And our objective was first to investigate the capture of microplastic using lipid component extracted from jackfruit seeds. Second, to solve the problem of water contamination caused by microplastic. And the last one, to develop a coating material from the lipid components extracted from jackfruit seeds to be more effective in microplastic capture. The next slide is the matter. We have three processes. Firstly, is extraction of lipid components from the jackfruit seed. Next is simulating water source containing microplastic. In the first process, we prepare a raw jackfruit seed and dehumidify them. Next, we mash it and then soak them in 70% of hexane for 48 hours. Then we extract lipid components with fractional distillation and keep the lipid components out of the direct sunlight, draw at a room temperature. The next process is simulating water source containing microplastic. Mixing microplastic in the amount of 2 grams per litre, the simulating water source was taken under a microscope and then numbered and calculated the result with image J. Next is coating lipid components and then we test two types of sieve in a simulation water source for five times. And the last process, we photograph the microplastic from the field of water with a microscope. Then record and analyze the result from the experiment with image A and summarize the experiment results. The next slide is the result. Two pictures on the left are the pictures of microplastic from the stimulated water. In the middle are pictures of microplastic from the stimulated water filtered by a standard sieve. On the right are the pictures of microplastic from the stimulated water filtered by a lipid coated sieve. The images above were taken with a microscope and the images below were analyzed by image J. This table shows the average microplastic size and the percentage of microplastic per total area. The following is the discussion of the results of our experiment. The percentage of remaining microplastic in filtered water per unfiltered water of each seed is shown in this table. Microplastic can be removed 94.064% using a lipid-coated sieve. It can be compared with magnetic ferrous fluid for microplastic extraction application. Our results were similar to this paper, and the lipid-coated sieve has a similar efficiency to the DAF method or dissolved air flotation. The lipid component extracted from jungle seeds were cultured to this sieve by applying hackation theory. Adhesive bounding and mechanical bounding of lipid substance can increase the efficiency of microplastic capture. Because this project is a simple idea that can be developed to use in future, it is a concept that uses hydrophobic substance ultra than lipid to adapt in real life. Using a ticketer can also make it more effective in adhesion and more durable. Therefore, it can be concluded that the lipid culture sieve from jungle seeds can increase the efficiency of microplastic capture. Thank you to our supervisor, Mr. Jirat Palopat, science and English teacher at Princess Dulapon San High School, Chiang Rai, for providing this project and providing a knowledge guide and support to success this project. Thank you for paying attention.